Good evening, President Houlihan and Board. My name is Kristen Gaspar, and I'm an Encinitas resident. I've spent considerable time on this particular agenda item, reviewing the staff reports, fiscal year 2009 recommendation, and drought response conservation ordinance for this particular agenda item. I'd like to encourage the board to abide by our own adopted rules tonight and return to the proper drought response level as defined by the drought response conservation ordinance, which should be a level one condition. According to our own drought response conservation ordinance, I'm going to quote here, a level one condition applies when the water authority notifies its member agencies that due to drought or other supply reductions, there is a reasonable probability that there will be supply shortages and that a consumer demand reduction of up to 10% is required to ensure that sufficient supplies will be available to meet the anticipated demands. A level two condition applies when the water authority notifies its member agencies that due to cutbacks caused by drought or other reductions in supplies, a consumer demand reduction of up to 20% is required in order to have sufficient supplies available to meet anticipated demands. My impression of the purpose of this document is to provide an evaluation tool for the district to determine the proper drought response level. The board mentioned consistency, but there seems to be a lack of consistency in the recommendation. Number one, a level one condition applies when a consumer demand reduction is required of up to 10%, yet the staff report clearly states a projected 8% reduction requirement for fiscal year 2010-2011. The staff report also states that we should align response levels with Santa Fe Irrigation District because we share water supply, but it makes more sense to align with the Levenhain Municipal Water District because we share service area. Levenhain, which serves half of Encinitas, has reduced to a level one. Number three, adopting the appropriate level one, one alert would help residents and businesses with reduced rates in this tough economy. The staff report fails to consider how reduced water bills will help our residents in the community who are struggling to make ends meet on a day-to-day -day basis. I spoke with two former small business owners this week in its neatest. Unfortunately, they've joined the ranks of the unemployed. I found it interesting that one of the vision document goals was to keep Encinitas citizens working locally. Every dollar back in our pockets helps us to achieve this goal. I sincerely hope that financial gains to the district are not weighing in on this decision. A consistent drought message doesn't provide any relief for our residents. If the argument is being made that consumers reduce consumption by 9% under level two and we can't risk reducing the status level one, wouldn't an amendment to the ordinance that defines the response levels be appropriate at this time? If we are deviating from this tool this time, the public should know why and what to expect moving into the future. Perhaps it's time to reevaluate our goals and plan for the multi-year cutbacks referenced in the staff report. At the end of the day, the public wants the Water District to follow the established rules and criteria laid out in the Drought Response Conservation Ordinance. Thank you.